Hey everybody, Robert Wheeler here with Whitebone Knives. Today uh, we're going to be talking about drill bits uh, and more importantly how to sharpen them. Um, right here on the left I have a new drill bit and then right here on the right I have a used drill bit. And as you can see, right here the edge looks pretty good. You know, it's just fresh out of the box. It's a really nice crisp edge. Um, and on this one, it's uh, kind of dinged up a bit. Uh, there you can see how flat it is right there on the edge. Um, right there, that side doesn't look too t terrible, but this side is what's giving me the trouble. And uh, when I drive this into some metal, it'll smoke a lot, and I won't get the good curls that I want uh, to see coming out of there. So uh, I'm going to show you how to sharpen them to get this to look like this. Alright guys, here we are at the front of the grinder. Um, that, this is what we're going to be used to sharpen our uh, drill bits with. So I just put on like a 110 grit belt. It's pretty worn out, uh, but it'll do the job for these. Um, I just want to show you the angle of what we have to sharpen. Um, it's going to be slight at a slight angle just like this. And you just kind of line it up with the drill bit. See how there's a slight taper? on each side you just line that up even with your belt just like so and then and then also you wanna you don't wanna go at it at a straight angle you wanna tilt it down just like this and then as it's moving you're gonna rock it back so let me see if I can get closer there So you're going to have it right there, and then rock it back, and then flip it over, put it on at the angle, and then rock it down. And I'll show you from the side as well, so you can kind of get a better idea of what I'm saying here. Okay, so I'm right here at the, des at the same angle that it's already at, and then you just rock it down. And, and don't... Um, you want this to have a real crisp edge to it, so, you know, if you go up angled like this, you're not going to be able to get uh, a good cut when you go down into something, um, because it needs to be slightly angled. So, you got to keep it on your regular taper of the drill, and then just rock it down. So, I'll show you, and then um, we'll go from there. Uh, just to show you again, this is the dinged up bit, so we're going to sharpen that and get it out of there. I'll start by going off at around a 40, a speed, pretty low speed, I don't want to go too fast. Alright, so I just did the one side, and now that uh, cleaned it up quite a bit, and now we have to just go ahead and do the other side. There we are, and it's uh, just as simple as that. You don't really need, um, you know, too much of anything special. Just uh, get a belt sander, whether you have a two by seventy two or you just have a, uh, you know, any 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 belt sander you can do it on. So um, there we go. Now we have a sharp drill bit, and we'll get really nice curls with that. Um, and uh, it saves you money. So go ahead and save you some money and just sharpen your own without buying new ones. So, all right, there you go, guys. Thanks for watching.